For me as a climber, chalk is probably one of the most essential tools. It's part of my artillery. Chalk is a compound of magnesium carbonate, actually from a rock that you take and you grind down and form into a powder, which then allows us to use for things like drying our hands. It's to keep your hands dry and to provide a better grip. It's gonna determine whether I can grab that next hold or not, and it's gonna allow me to just feel a little more confident when I'm grabbing a certain hold. There's so many different kinds of chalk, it's kind of overwhelming. You have block chalk, you've got giant bags of chalk you can buy in bulk. You have Matoli, Frank Endo, Black Diamond, you've got all these different brands. Basically, they're all the same, but you will notice that there's different textures, there's different granulars, and some have a drying agent. The chalk is stored in a chalk bag. You'll see as the climbers are climbing, they're constantly dipping in the back to get a little more chalk on their hands, whether it's in between a move or you're at a rest. Chalk bags are another thing that come in all shapes, sizes, designs, styles. It's one way that I guess a climber can you know, separate themselves from somebody else. Sometimes when you are going up a new route, a new boulder problem, you make marks. And this allows you to see where the holds are. There's a hold hidden and it's hard to see. You can make a little chalk mark that we call tick marks to mark where your hold might be. Go for it and grab. All chalk bags will have a brush holder. You store your toothbrush. It's basically a simple brush used to brush chalk off to clean holes that are dusty. Of course, after you're done, you want to brush the tick mark off. You want to clean the holds for the next climber. This is a part of etiquette. This is a part of courtesy, and it's basically the all around right thing to do. So whether you're at the boulders, the gym, the cliff, wherever you're out climbing, have a great time doing it. Keep those hands dry, brush your tick marks off, clean the base of the crag if you make a mess, and always take care.